Hello, and welcome to Resident Evil 4, again. I played the original on the channel a few years ago, but this is, of course, the newly released remake. If you want to find out more, the links and the details are down below in the description, as usual. I'm sure, like me, many of you have been waiting for this for a long, long time, and I'm not going to make you wait any longer. Let's get started. This is Resident Evil 4. Oh? That was new. That wasn't in the demo. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. The cop inside me died that day. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out, thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. The training. Punishing missions. Nearly killed me. But at least I kept my mind off everything. If I could just forget what happened that night. The pain. Even for a second. This time, it can be different. It has to. Difference not always good, Leon. So tell me, Yankee, why did you come to this horrible place, as close to nowhere that I've ever seen? Let's just say, looking for someone. That someone must be very important, huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. I'm sure your boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> or maybe you did. <laughs> you have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here, and it's been that way for a while now. You're not very good at your job then, are you? Well then, it should be just another day in the office, right? <laughs> I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. I'm sure you'll do your best to help me. Mm. <laughs> I think you might be right. Nature calls, huh? I'll be right back. Hmm. <laughs> That's what you think. Qué frío. ¿Te has bebido el bar entero? You smoke? No, don't go that way. You definitely don't want to go that way. He's going that way. Well, it was nice knowing him. Kinda. He sure is taking his time. Did he fall in? Maybe you better go and take a look. Yeah. Maybe I better. Alright. Oh, watch the car. Wouldn't want to get a parking ticket. <laughs> so much for helping me. Yeah. 
I think that's really all they hope you're going to get. And here we are, pretty seamlessly into the gameplay, chapter one. So obviously I've played the original Resident Evil 4 and I've also played the Chainsaw demo for the remake, so I've been through this area before. I've got to see what's taking so long. Right. So, yeah, let's just take in the sights. This game is beautiful, it really is. Uh, we're quite limited to what we can do. I don't think we've got access to our inventory. We can't get the knife or the gun out quite yet. We can walk, we can run, that's right. How far could he have gone? Yeah, well, let's go find out, shall we? Yeah, we can run, and I think we can examine as well. Yeah, this guy's seen better days. Alright, well, it looks like the officer has gone this way. So we're going to follow him. Yeah, it feels so much darker and more claustrophobic. I love it. Eat a crouch and stand, that's right. And here we are. The first house of the village. And I can see a light on, so I guess that means someone's home, right? Let's see. Are we going to knock on the door? Of course we're not. We're just going to let ourselves in. <laughs> and pretty soon, we're going to wish that we didn't. Anyone home? Oh. Alright. Let's see. Let's get out of here. I can't. I can't leave. Right. I guess that was a one-way door. Alright, so let's see. Through here? Okay. Uh, as I recall, there was actually something to find. Yeah, on the bed here. What's this? Alright. It's a crude charm that says, Judgment is nigh, on the back of it. Wonderful. That's going to be added to my files, which I don't think I can access quite yet, but uh, fairly soon I'll be able to. Yeah, uh, whoever's living here is living in some pretty rough conditions by the looks of it. Alright. X marks the spot, eh? Let's go this way. There's a very imposing looking door up ahead. Uh, I don't think I've got the key for it at the moment, so I'm just going to ignore that. And I'm going to go this way over here. Alright. So far, it's been exactly like the demo. Hey! You must be the man of the house. Who doesn't seem all that bothered about you being there. Uh, sorry to barge in like this. Nope. Not bothered at all. <laughs> I like that he's trying to speak Spanish. He's speaking it better than I can. That's never good. Mario's police badge covered in blood. Whoop! Right? That knife's gonna come in very handy. As are my legs, because those kicks are something else. Oh, he's done. Ooh. Is that Mario, do you think? Maybe he's not done for quite yet. Right. The Hunter's Lodge key. I think that's going to get me through that door behind me. Alright. Now, of course, I've got access to my gun. I've got the knife. And we can see what's brewing in the pot here. Man, that stinks. Wish you didn't take a look now. Right. Okay. Uh, so, there are going to be various barrels and boxes that we can destroy for items and such, but I don't think there's any in here. We've just got dead animals. Right. Something on the floor down here, let's see. Right, yeah, it's the badge. Mario Fernandez Castano. And it's covered in blood. Okay. So, back this way. It seems like you can walk through the doors or you can press F. Kind of depends on what sort of situation you're in. Right, so here we are. Okay. 
In it goes, it's the perfect fit, and we're through. A little bit darker around here. Oh boy, yeah. You wouldn't catch me going down here, I can tell you that much. Bloody hell. More of these strange charms, made out of giant nails this time. Nooses? Wonderful. Oh boy. What does that say, I wonder? Are we going to get a translation? Unfortunately not. Alright, hang on. I'm hearing something from back here. That would be Mario, I think. Yeah. His throat cut. I read you. What's your situation? He's getting a parking ticket. What the hell's going on? Good question, Leon. Good, good question. Right, okay. Escape from the Hunter's Lodge. Yeah, we never should have come in here, really. Now we're getting taught about readying our weapon and shooting, so you know what's going to happen next. Uh, so let's see, if I take a look at the map here, there we go. So we've got the map, we've got the key items and treasures. There's my item case, which I think I can expand as the game goes on. Uh, we're going to do a little bit of inventory management here and there. We can craft in this game as well, so we can make handgun ammo, shotgun shells, lots and lots of different mixed herbs, and there's of course the files, everything that we've been picking up. But right, yeah, let's, let's get out of here. What was that? Someone's around by the sounds of it. Oh, oh, and it's him! Oh, oh, oh! Is he down? Okay, he's down. This just keeps getting worse. Yes, it does. Yeah, I thought breaking your neck would be the end of you, but apparently not. Whew, right. So, I think if he did grab me. I could defend myself with the knife, but that would use some of its durability. You can see the bar down there in the bottom right. It's not going to last forever. Let's see, through here. Uh, ooh. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this stealthy. That's kind of what I did in the demo, and it sort of worked. Alright. Yeah, so that wall was actually a door. We got something here? Okay, brilliant! A green herb. That's going to help me with healing. I uh, don't know if there's anything else. Right, we're going to have to go upstairs now. Alright. Anything up here? Doesn't seem like it. I'd like some more ammo. Yeah, I've only got three rounds. <laughs> oh, that's right. Leon being very loud as he stealths around the house. We have a map of the area. And a picture of the president's daughter. Bruce, this is Gondor 1. Hunnigan here, what's your sit rep? The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. Why even use code Our names? Our intel was correct then. Well done. <laughs> Need a location on a nearby lake. She may have been taken there. Mm. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are... In deep trouble. Just like you. Gotta go. Talk later. Alright. Three rounds. Three headshots? Nope. Not when there's a window around. Yeah, he doesn't have the stones to do it himself. And I'm quite glad for it, to be honest. Alright, here we are then. On the other side of the building. I don't know if we can go back to the car. Okay, nothing around here? Doesn't seem like it. We've just got to head for the lake. That's what we're going to be doing for the, uh, for the large part of the village, is trying to head to that lake. Alright. Yeah, following the blood. But the blood of who? 
Reminds me a little bit of uh, Resident Evil Village, actually, this bridge. That was a great game. Yeah. After I finished recording it, I did go back and try and sort of speedrun it with some extra weapons. And yeah, it's, it's so fun. Ah, right. I might not have many bullets left, but it might be worth shooting the birds around here. Yeah. Let's see. What have you got for me? A ruby! Wow, okay, that's a good find. I think at a certain point there will be a chance to sell things, and uh, hopefully I can get my pesetas up. Right. There we are. Twelve handgun bullets in a barrel for some reason. So it's the, uh, the barrels and the boxes that are covered in yellow paint. They're the ones that I'm looking for. Right. So, there's a typewriter over here. Let's have a look. Oh, fantastic. Okay. I've got a charm. Alright. So, do we need ink ribbons? Let's see. I don't think we do. I'm only playing on standard. Maybe on hardcore you need to find some ink ribbons to save, but it seems like, at least on this difficulty, that's something that I don't need to worry about. Got some gunpowder down there. That's good. Alright. Anything else? Doesn't seem like it. Right. Someone's around. I can't... Yeah, I can... I can hear them. They're through there somewhere. Right, we've got a couple more birds, though. Did I get it? Ah, I got it. Fantastic. Right. Hopefully that wasn't a waste. Right. There we go, we've got some Pesetas. There's the currency in the game. And i got some gunpowder as well. They're definitely to the right. I don't know if there's anyone in here. Right, okay, let's see. More handgun ammo, the more the merrier. I think that's all we're going to find, right. We're going to have to sneak up here. Okay. You see these traps around? That dog was caught in one. Hopefully I don't get caught in one myself. Oh, oh boy. Right, okay. <laughs> it's time to evacuate. Definitely time to evacuate. Oh, oh! That hurt. Oh, hang on. So there you go, there's a prompt for melee. Ooh, what's this? Oh, you can finish him off with the knife! Ah, but of course that uses durability as well. You're gonna have to figure out how to get different knives or repair them. Right. There's a box there. Handy. I seem to recall that going a lot smoother in the demo. <laughs> I actually got through the upcoming section very, very quickly in the demo. It's probably not going to be the same again. Right. For some reason, I think there's meant to be three here, but I only killed the two. Right, there is one of the traps. That's what I've got to avoid. Okay. Is there someone in here? There is, isn't there? There we are. Very nice. Wow, that kick actually put him down. I love it. Okay, so we get a red herb, and like all the Resident Evil games, you mix these with the green herbs to make a better health drink. A flash grenade, right? Yep, okay. I, I might be using that later. We'll see. Hangar ammo, lovely. All right. Looks like that's all we're going to find. Let's go into this, though, and, yeah, let's do a little bit of crafting, shall we? So we can register shortcuts to that as well. Wonderful, right. So, craft. Okay, it gives you the list of things that you can combine with it, which is quite nice. So, yeah, green and red. You just need to hold that down. Done. Brilliant. Okay. We've also got this first aid spray, which I think gets my full health back up, which is quite nice. But yeah, we've got we've got eight slots for weapons. That's crazy. I'm gonna need a bigger case. But yeah, the flash grenade came in very handy in the demo. I wonder if it's gonna come in handy again. 
as we go through this very intimidating looking gate. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Welcome to the village. All right, hang on. I think there's actually a place I can use my binoculars. We can see what's going on. That's a bit harsh for a parking ticket. Shit. Right, yeah. Okay, I, I think it's time to stop looking down the binoculars, then it's time to sort of have a little look around the village, don't you? I was a little bit too late to save that guy, but I don't know. Maybe I can save myself. Alright, let's creep around. Okay. I think this is the exact same way I did it in the demo. I'm a man of habit, what can I say? There's a box to destroy, uh, there's someone to kill as well. A window to jump through, maybe? Alright. And she's down. She's down, okay. Based on the durability, I think I can do that, I don't know. Seven times? Something like that? Okay. More besaters. Right. This house right here, I'm going to want to get in. Unfortunately, there's no window to dive through. Alright. We're going to go in here. What are we going to find? Let's have a look. It's a hand grenade. Okay, right. Let's see. That could come in useful. All right. I think there might be someone up there as well. There is. Okay. All right. All right. Like before, I'm going to see, you know, how many kills I can get away with before they actually notice me. I don't think it's going to be too long, honestly, before they do. Just for a second, I thought that was the chicken saying that. Can I? Okay, yep, yep, that's subtle. <laughs> Alright. There might be something in here. Let's see. Oh, it's locked! Oh, I'm gonna need a key. I have no keys at all at the moment. That's not good. Alright, I think they uh, I think they may have heard that. Oh boy. Yeah, they definitely did. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Fight them up. Wait, what? Oh boy, okay, right. Now I think it might be time to go into the house, don't you? Alright. Come on, come on. Let's just get this done. There's a certain man that I want to meet. I mean, not really, but he's gonna decide to meet me anyway. Oh boy. Come on, there we go. Bar the door. Might be able to block it as well, I'm not sure. There he is. Dr. Salvador with his surgical equipment, I guess. And they're coming in upstairs as well. Not a great place to be. Or is it? Right. Here we are. Here we are. Okay. Got myself a shotgun. Nice. Very nice. And what seems to be another hand grenade. Right. They're coming in. Can't let that happen. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. It sounds like it sounds like he's coming in. What we got here? Shotgun shells. Okay. Great. Great. the end of him. Okay. Oh, this might be a waste. Oh. He is not a fight that I want to deal with right now. Oh, okay. Right. So, as I recall, I don't know if this is going to go the same way. What I did is I equipped this I dropped it around here, and then I equip this really quickly, for you. and I blew them all up. Right. I don't know if that's killed enough of them to get to the next sequence. I don't think so. Oh bloody hell, a brown chicken egg. Right. Oh. 
Oh, bloody hell. Okay, he just keeps on coming. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. Oh, uh, oh, 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 wait, what's going on? He's round there now? Oh, and that's collapsing? Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> no, unfortunately not, no. Right, up we go. Come on. Might be time to go back to the shotgun, to be honest. Oh, jeez. Oh, here we go. Right. They do. They do. It was so much easier in the demo. Maybe they made it a little bit harder. Right, let's see. What about this tower? Can we go up the tower? Uh, it looks like we can. Yes, okay. Have I just put myself into a really bad dead end, though? I don't know. There's a green herb. Right there. Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Right, I need to get out of here. Oh, boy. There's just so many of them. Right, let's see. What do I get here? Some gunpowder. Yep. I don't know if this is really the time, honestly, to uh, to do a bit of crafting. What on earth? Oh, that's the sound I was after. That bell. Huh? They all get distracted by it. Maybe I should pick a few more off. Ah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Leon's quite confused. This community, with all its strange customs, is very religious, as it turns out. everyone going? Bingo? <laughs> there you go. He said the thing. He said the thing. Welcome to Resident Evil 4. Man, okay. That was actually a lot tougher than I thought it was going to be. Went a lot smoother in the demo. Whew. Well, okay. Let's see. Now, now I've got rule of the roots. Now I can actually go around and, and see what I missed. Condor One. I've identified a route to the lake. Oh yeah. Look for a large windmill. There's a path on the far side of it. Right. Windmill. Copy that. All right. That's going to be somewhere over be there, careful. I think. Roost out. Okay. So uh, yeah, this is why you don't park illegally. These people are sick. They are indeed. Right. So yeah, open the map. Right. Yeah, we want to go down this path, I think. There might be a door over there, um, but yeah, there's uh, there's no way we're going that way right now. Let's go around and let's see what we missed. Okay. Pesaters, handgun ammo. The cow coming out on fire, that was a nice surprise. <laughs> oh boy, I really went through my ammo, didn't I? I went through all the ammo for the shotgun. Went through my flash grenade, my grenade. It was a good use of it, but phew, I'd like it back now, please. Another hand grenade, okay. Some of them, it seems, were hiding in the cupboards. Yeah, they're in the wardrobes. That's something I wasn't expecting. Resources. Small resources. Okay. There's gunpowder down there. What did you drop? Some pesetas. I wonder if there's, you know, hidden treasures around here. <laughs> I could have used that ladder, but no, that's not Leon's style. 
Right, let's go up here. This isn't the way that we're meant to be going, but it does lead to a gate. A gate that I don't think I'll be able to get through. Nah, not from this side. Maybe a little later on. Alright. A red herb. Good stuff. Just need a green one now. The red herb doesn't really do much on its own. Here we are then. This is the church that transfixed them when the bells rang. Can I go in? Not without the right key. Okay. I'll be coming back a little bit later on. Around here? Let's see. That looks interesting. Ooh, a green herb. There we are. Oh, okay. We've got a little box here. Oh, we find a ruby in the case. Wonderful. More handgun ammo. Lovely. Nothing hidden behind the door. You can destroy that, but there's nothing inside it. Right. I think we're out of here. I think we're moving on now. This way. Hopefully this will work. Alright. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there's the windmill. This part wasn't in the demo, by the way. This is this is kind of like a blind playthrough now. Yeah, I was sort of vaguely half confident before, but <laughs> not anymore. Not anymore. Right, let's save. All right. I can hear them, so maybe it's best I stealth around. Okay. There's another egg. Another delicacy on the floor. Just the normal one this time. Right. Okay. It doesn't seem like they've noticed me yet, so I am going to try and get away with some sneaky kills. really does worry me about that durability, though. I'm going to have to figure out a way of repairing that, because I think you do repair it rather than find others in this game. Can't go in. No good. No good. Right. There's definitely someone inside. Hang on. Is that what I think it is? Is that... That's a blue medallion, isn't it? Right. Uh, can I just, like, shoot that? Or can I hit that with my knife? I can. Wonderful. Right. I'm going to sneak over here if I can. There we are. And another one bites the dust. Okay. Is that? Yeah, there is one up there. I think there was one in a similar location before. Oh, really? This one? I don't know if I can chop this one. Right, I'm going to shoot. That'll get him out. Probably. Or not. No. Did I not get anyone's attention? I'm not seeing a pitchfork getting thrown at me or anything, so maybe not. There we go. I can't recall exactly what the blue medallions do, but I think it's probably best if I find them all before I move on. Ah, there's one up there. That one, I think I'm going to have to shoot. There we are. Just one more to find. Okay. Looks like there's a note over here. Let's see. Destroy the blue medallions. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Got a bit of a head start here, but sure. Oh, we get three uh, spinels or spinels. That's right. Okay. So where is the fifth one? Somewhere around here? Not in the boxes. Just some pesetas. Oh, I couldn't get in through the back door. What about the front door? No, that's not working either. is this? Ooh, now that needs a very special key indeed. Through here. 
All right, yep, it's unlocked. Oh, right. Yeah, there's uh, there's a tripwire in front of me. Thankfully, I heard the beeping. Uh, I, I I guess I can probably shoot it. Oh, yep, yep. Just for a second, I thought I'd just give myself. Uh, thankfully, no. Right. Ah, looks like we're going up there. Anyone else down here, though? Oh, dear. A yellow herb. Right, okay. Well, that's going to increase the potency of healing items, I believe. Right, let's go up, shall we? Hello. <laughs> Is it you I've been hearing all this time? Come on. That's it. Is she down? She's down. She's dropping her money. She must be down. Ah, uh, this is our way into this building, is it? I'll come back and I'll use that lever in a moment, but there's still one more of these things to find. I wonder if it's maybe in here. I'm going in. Okay. I don't like the sound of that. Can we get this open? Oh, we can. Ah, more handgun ammo. Great. It does pay to hang around, I think. Ah, there it is. That's it! Five out of five! So, uh, a little bit later on, I guess I'll be collecting my reward. Right. There's someone out there now. There didn't used to be. Oh, boy. Okay, time to go. Definitely time to go. <laughs> Who's this guy? Oh! Who the hell are you? Well, now you tell me about reloading. Yeah, alright. Oh boy. Oh my god. Hey, is he down? Please tell me he's down. Oh my god. Does this guy die or is he just a bullet sponge? Oh my god, right. Well, he's dead, but at what cost, right? Maybe me shooting his head was a bad idea. Maybe he was pretty well protected wearing that cow's head. I'm sorry, what was that? Where did that come from? Was that... Did that come from inside? I think it did. I think it did. Oh, <laughs> two in one. Oh, hell. Oh. Honestly, might not be the best idea. Present for you. <laughs> but it seemed like a pretty good one. I'm just curious what this guy had, honestly. Velvet blue, right? Hopefully that sells for a lot. Jeez Louise. Right. So, where was I? What was I gonna do? Over here, that's right. Does this still work? It does. And it looks like there's a way down to a... Oh, is that a chest? Interesting. All right, I'll be having a look at that in a moment. Right. Ah, we're missing a gear, aren't we? I think I actually saw one down here. Yeah, okay. So we actually had to go through that. Honestly, so far so good. I love the way it sounds, love the way it looks, the mechanics, the controls. It's all been great so far. And to be honest, the challenge, the challenge is there. For a game that I've played through before, kind of, yeah. I, I'm actually quite on edge. I'm, I'm quite tense just walking around because I don't really know what to expect. And yeah, it seems like some of the villagers take a long time to go down. Is that a kitchen knife? I'm kind of curious about that. Right. Right, okay, so maybe when that one's down, we can use that. Or maybe I should use that now. Yeah. Save the combat knife for a little bit later on, perhaps. Can we get these open as well? <laughs> can I just keep on kicking? I can't, great. <laughs> no, that one's not going to work. Locked. Okay, well, I've got the cog. That's all that matters. Okay. 
There we are. It's the perfect fit. Now let's try this again. Alright. Always a little bit worrying, because I don't know what I'm going to be letting in as well. But yeah, back this way. I, I think I did see a chest. I'm very curious about that. Alright. Ooh. Flagon. Yeah, okay. Very fancy. Oh, you can combine the treasures. That's right, you can add jewels to them. I guess this is one of those ones where you can add jewels. Um, I'm, I'm curious. Let's see. Inlay gemstones? That's right. Yeah. So that goes in number one. Okay. I guess I can put in another one, but maybe it'll do better if I find another jewel. So I'll leave that for now. Yeah. Good stuff, though. Good stuff. Come on. Three times? Yep. Three's the magic number. Okay. Something in here? Yep. Right. Now I think it's time to go. Oh, God. It's time to go across another very ropey-looking rope bridge. Yeah. It's familiar bit different. That's another thing I like about it. It's not like I'm playing the same game. Not quite. I think for the most part we're going to be following the same kind of story beats, but there's going to be different layouts, different locations, different enemies, like that bull-headed guy from before. Things to keep me on my toes. Things to make it different. This looks pretty intimidating, this place. Right. Something here. Oh? Oh, we can move this out of the way? Okay. There we are. Well, that must be heavy. Alright. That gives us access down there. Is that the way that we need to go? Let's see. Lago. Lake. Yeah, okay. Lake's gotta be this way. Indeed. Can we go in here? No. Okay. I think I might know what house that is. And no, it's, it's not time for it quite yet. Something around here? Ooh. Some more resources. I'm sorry if I'm taking long, by the way, but I do want to be quite thorough. I do want to see what I can find if I explore a little more. And to be honest, the uh, the way I'm playing the game, I'm going to need all the help I can. There we are. All right. Is this a warning sign? <laughs> I think they're all warning signs, but maybe that one's warning me about something specifically. Un oh, oh boy. Evade! Okay, not what I was expecting. Uh, oh, really? Oh, we can't go that way. Oh, and they're just, they're just throwing things at me. Oh boy. Right. Let's get back up here, shall we? We might need to go up there, I'm not sure. Okay, put him down. Kick to the face. Is that him done? That's him done. Brilliant. Can we climb up here? No, we can't. Right. There's got to be a way up, though, right? I don't think I can go round. Hmm. Ah, you can shoot them out the air. That's what I was trying to do. He's down. And so's he. Just knocked him off the bridge. Right. Ah, there is a way around. Didn't notice this. Oh. Is there another one? I don't know. <laughs> Just keep expecting something else to collapse on me. Okay, some more Pesaters. Handgun ammo. Brilliant. And then through this tunnel. Can I get the flashlight out again, please? It's a little bit dark. No? Alright, guess not. Okay, looks like we've got some bats here. That you can't shoot? Oh. 
Oh, I was hoping they were going to drop things like the birds did. Never mind. All right. Ah. Oh. Okay. Uh, I think they've seen me coming. They're rushing off for some reason. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Right. I think some of them have sticks of dynamite. Yes, they definitely do. And you can shoot the dynamite, just like the original. Fantastic. That guy's still alive. Keep coming. Not for long. Oh, if only my legs were, you know, really, really long, I'd kick you both. I'm just wondering what I can do. Like, can I shoot the weapons out of their hands sometimes? I guess not. Come on, that's it, that's it. That's it! Kick them both, kick them both. Oh, wow. Okay, exploding headshots, they're definitely a thing. Look at all this money. Right, I think it's time to use some of that gunpowder, don't you? Let's see. Handgun ammo, so, yeah. Uh, I might as well. Okay. Craft bonus. That's nice. Maybe the game's feeling sorry for me. Uh oh. Alright. Sounds like there's someone around. But there's also a tripwire in front of me. Uh, where? Oh, it was on the roof. Where's she then? Oh, I think I can... Yeah, I think I can see her. Alright. There's a trap there as well. Is she gonna come down? Is she gonna play nice? Can I vote over this? Right. I gotta check for trip wires. I gotta check for bear traps. There we go. Come on. There we go. Ow. Oh. I probably should have done it. Next. Ne oh, God. No, no, no. That seems pretty devastating, honestly. Let's go inside. Uh oh. Well, that's one way to destroy a barrel, I suppose. I'm going to go back outside now. It's still her, isn't it? Right. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna put an end to her. Oh, look at that! Come on. Is she down? She may have collapsed. I don't think she's getting back up. I think she's down. Right. Maybe I can actually explore this. Right, okay, so in here. What else we got? More money, right. What is that sound? I, I, <laughs> I don't like it. I'm extremely suspicious of it, to be perfectly honest with you. Can't open that up. Obviously, we're not getting that door open. Uh, I don't think there's anything we need to worry about. Thank God. Okay. There's another trap. Right, let's move on. Another one. Oh, not again. Oh, I was I was going for it. I was going for it. There we go. That's the money shot right there. Ah, oh, we can go up. Okay, good, good, good. It might actually benefit me to get some height here. Okay, so yeah, it turns out she did die. Wow. 
on, get on here, lovely. He may have been the last one, I'm not sure. Probably not. Ooh, what's this? Okay, I think I'm gonna need another fancy key, aren't I? Or at least a key. I haven't found a key yet. I'll have to come back a little bit later. What is that I can hear? Oh, I think I might know. We'll deal with that in a sec. Right, we're on the edge of uh, the lago. Yeah, I don't know if I want to get too close, actually. Yeah, okay, nothing to find. Nothing to find. I wonder if I can, like, do some fishing in this game as well. Alright. Looks like that used to be a walkway, but not anymore. Some potatoes, alright. Is this the place? Seems like it might be. Hmm. We'll go in there in a sec. Is there anything around the corner? Looks like there might be another one of these boxes, but again, it needs one of these fancy keys, doesn't it? Yeah, that's right. Whatever I'm hearing is coming from inside. Let's see. Is that another locked drawer? It is. Is that beeping I can hear as well? Might be a tripwire. Oh, it is. It is. Okay, right. Um... I, I don't think I can crouch under that. But annoyingly, I don't think I can shoot it either. Maybe from the back corner here? Okay, alright, there we are. Alright. Something in here. Here we are, more resources. That means I should be able to make some more ammo. What's this? Oh. Huh. Who's this, I wonder? Nothing on the back? Nothing to say? No engraving? Nothing like that? Okay. I'm just going to add that to files, I suppose. What's that noise? Yeah, what is that noise? We're going to need to get this out of the way to find out. Okay. Ooh. Oh, hello. Oh, that's... that's not good. I'm going in for it. Oh, hopefully it was worth it. It was indeed. What have we got here then? Okay. Gotta pull the boards off, pull the planks away. It's a hatch. Alright. Uh <laughs> Fantastic, he's light as a feather. Do I drop down? I don't know. I'm second-guessing myself now. Can we not open these? Oh, we can! Hang on. Oh! Oh, okay. I'm glad I second-guessed myself, actually. That was sort of glinting. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I don't think I should shoot it. I think I should drop down. Okay. Oh, now he gets the flashlight out. Better late than never, Leon. Better late than never. Right. Let's see who's inside. I don't think it's going to be Ashley, the president's daughter. That would be a very short game. <laughs> that hurts, you know? It seemed like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? I know those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just untie me then, huh? <laughs> <clears throat> Oh, there. Ooh. Not this guy. Who are you? Ooh. Stop right there. Ooh, he looks good. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, no. That is not good. But that, it seems, is where the chapter comes to an end, so that's where this video is going to come to an end. In the future, I might do a couple of chapters of video, but right now I just want to say thank you very much for watching part one of the Resident Evil 4 remake. I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. It's similar, it's familiar, but it's different. 
and it feels like a completely new experience and a really fun one at that. I can't wait to start chapter two. I'll see you there. Just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here. And it's been that way for a while now. You're not very good at your job then, are you? No, don't go that way. You definitely don't want to go that way. Are we going to knock on the door? Of course we're not. We're just going to let ourselves in. <laughs> that knife's going to come in very handy. As are my legs. What's your situation? He's getting a parking ticket. What's your sit rep? The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. Why even use code names? We've got eight slots for weapons. That's crazy. I'm going to need a bigger case. That's a bit harsh for a parking ticket. Okay, yep, yep, that's subtle. <laughs> they do. They do. There's a green herb. Right there. Whoa! Whoa! Maybe I should pick a few more off. Ah! <laughs> Where's everyone going? Bingo? <laughs> there you go. He said the thing. <laughs> I could have used that ladder, but no, that's not Leon's style. Okay, time to go. Definitely time to go. <laughs> Who's this guy? Oh! Who the hell are you? Oh my god. Does this guy die, or is he just a bullet sponge? Oh boy. Evade! Okay. Not what I was expecting. I think some of them have sticks of dynamite. Yes, they definitely do. And you can shoot the dynamite, just like the original. Fantastic. It's a hatch. Alright. Uh, 